try to relax. After all, you were chosen to be here. I shall now test your God Art compatibility and your potential to join the anti aragon Purity Force, the God Eaters. I say test, but please don't concern yourself with such words. All will be well, I assure you. The Restless God already knows all about your nascent potential. <laughs> I wish you the best of luck. Incompatible? Not this one. Look closely. What is going on YouTube? This is your boy Red Devil King here and I am back on um, my brother's PS4 because my PS4 broke so it didn't break it like malfunctioned in a way so anyway I come to you guys with some God Eater I play God Eater I played this God Eater on my brother's Vita as well so I already know what to do and how to play and all that other good shit so I'm going to be telling y'all about how my PlayStation is um, sadly messed up and I had to sell it in just a minute. So I'll be right back after I do the tutorial and all that good shit. So um, see you devils in a minute. Okay, so I forgot to um, explain to y'all how my PlayStation got messed up. I'm going to try to explain this in a few short words, alright? <clears throat> so, I was watching anime, it cut off, I turned it back on. Started watching anime again, it went off, it did that like three times. So I turned it back on for the final time, it went to the main menu screen, and I couldn't log into my um, PlayStation account. So, um, it said I need a computer to do a reinstallation, I was going to have to start all over. So, that's basically it. And I was pretty pissed about that, so now I gotta wait until Christmas to get a whole new PlayStation. So, that's how that happened. Alright, enjoy the rest of the video. everyone's been talking about yes sir we're both really excited to work with you sir sir <laughs> that has a nice ring to it the name's Romeo if there's anything you need to know I'm your guy ask away I'll tell you one thing though blood is tough so you'd better be ready to give it your all huh oh well that's a good question so Thus, um, blood is okay. So there's this blood power, and uh, oh, uh, if if it if it you know wakes up, it can get these cool skills. Our captain's skill is super awesome. He comes up against an origami, right? And then, bam, slash, explosion! He just crushes the thing. That's so cool. Can you tell us about your special skill, sir, Romeo, sir? Oh, hey, hey, come on, don't ask that kind of thing. I it's not easy to get a special skill, kind of personal. Oh, uh, I know. Why don't you take those questions to Dr. Rachel? She's the one who founded Blood. <laughs> See ya. 
that walk what? though. <laughs> Is question and answer time over already? Did I ask something I shouldn't have? And we're back. So after that mess of uh, Q and A, Romeo and his explanation of blood. Yeah, that was just terrible. Um, I think we have to go to Rachel. Yep. Okay. I think um after Rachel, I think I got like maybe two more. Julie is real fast. So you're here to see Dr. Rachel. I have something to discuss with you too. Come see me when you finish with Dr. Rachel right there. So after her, I think it's um, maybe two more training methods. Welcome new new candidates of the blood unit. I had planned to host a official dinner, however. Huh? You're just a candidate too. Nana, shut up. <laughs> you don't know who she is. <laughs> I'm glad to see you all getting along so well. Today I'm going to share with you the mission and purpose of the Elite Blood Unit. Cool, we're all ears, ma'am. Origami brought mankind to the brink of ruin. Only God Eaters had the power to hold back the tide. It is our aim to usher in a new era. Blood is the best of the best, superior to any God Eater. Awesome. Yeah, we are. With Julius and our special powers, nothing can stop us. Precisely, you are chosen. Your strength of wheels lies dormant in your veins, but we can awaken it. <coughs> Pardon me, I'm sick, y'all. <clears throat> when members of our unit undergo this awakening, they will uplift and inspire other guy eaters. Romeo, Nana, as well as you, and Captain Julius. <laughs> you don't know my name. As members of blood, it is your duty to lead the guy eaters to teach them of their true potential. Right now, the blood power lies quiet inside you, but I know that you have the will to quicken it the fuck that's supposed to mean quicken <laughs> i eagerly await oh, that day i won't let you down true. dr rachel yeah i know uh you'll do great romeo hey your blood too you know you've got to awaken your potential with us see on a vita i just blew past all the fucking reading because it's like i don't really need to read it but i got to with y'all so Kinda sucks a little bit, but that's alright. I just skipped the first part. Uh, I don't know what they said. I think it's time for the next step. We call it field training, but in a way, it's another test. Think of it as a gauge of your abilities, a way to see how you'll measure up as a god eater. All right. So basically, we're going out and we're actually fighting. Big it. Captain Julius, I was not informed that you would be accompanying the new recruit. That's a big ass girl. My apologies, friend. I simply have a great deal of confidence in them. I wish to see their talents firsthand. Yes, of course. Well, I hope they live up to your expectations, Captain. Good luck. Good, you're here. Cadet Second Class Nana Kozuki reporting for duty in the Blood Special Forces Unit, sir! I'm so super proud to be here! Welcome to Blood. I am Captain Julius Visconti. That's a rich name. Now, without further ado, let's begin your field training. What? Look out there. Those are the beasts that threaten the future of the human race. The Aragami. Hey, Ogi. How you slay them is of no concern, but do not halt until they stop breathing. Understood? <gasps> Wait, you mean we're, we're fighting Aragami like right now? Like, for real? Indeed, Cadet. You would learn little if you never fought in a real oh, battle. Oh, shit, that says Cadet. Do all I'm that just I know saying you Candy. Can, <laughs> no threat. All right. Oh, I'm an idiot. Oh, you say that until that happens. <laughs> Damn! 
Kill him. Nigga, you strong. Humanity has faced enemies since ancient times. Humanity has always prevailed. I know we do not have sharp fangs and rending claws to face off against our foes. But we have gifts they do not possess. Strategy, unity, cooperation. And most of all, the strength of will that binds us together. Willpower is the fiercest weapon. Our fiercest weapon. Never forget that. It's time. Forward! Legiri. This mission's origami are not usually prone to violence, but let's remain cautious. We're here to support you, Captain. Oh, I'm with the dad. The origami is disengaging. It's heading for food. No, what I mean. Okay, this game is a heavy reminder of Monster Hunter, and I like that a lot. It's very smooth. I like it's a smoother version, I guess. I don't know, cause I never played Monster Hunter, but that's we have an origami <laughs> response on our scanners. It's close. What breed? An ogre tail. Very well, Oxa. Shit. Prepare to defend yourselves. All right. Defense on point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That already. Okay, so <clears throat> gotta explain some shit. So basically, in a Vita version of this, I am actually playing as a heavy hitter with the um the heavy. I think it's the heavy sword, or the buster sword, that's what it's called. I'm using the buster sword. And there's, um, Cadets, I think six? you've done well today. Uh, this is an ideal opportunity to demonstrate the abilities you are to awaken. Okay, let me stop talking so you can talk. Oh, wow, so awesome! I focused that willpower to execute a blood art. Stand fast! What's a blood art? A talent that can shift the very tide of battle in your favor. Blood arts are innate skills, forged of the fire in your veins. Oh, that's lit. That was a blood art. This power within us will constantly develop and strengthen as we do. With it, we can face any origami. Always remember that this is a part of you. Nothing can stand against it. Alrighty then. I gotta get back to the main menu. I mean, not main menu. The uh, loadout menu so I can explain what I'm about to tell y'all. Yes, I know. The vending machine. Alright. So, uh, oof, excuse me, load out. Alright, so, this is the short blade, you can see it at the bottom of the screen, it just says, um, type is short blade, that's a combo related blade, so it's like, this blade is made for combos, basically, and then this is a long blade, it's a, it's like, it's in the middle between combo and like dealing damage so it's like a good standard base blade and it's a long blade i think i said that already 
then this is the one I was talking about I used in the Vita version which is the Buster Blade that's your really that's the main heavy hidden blade I can't talk right now fucking trying to save breath cuz I'm sick <coughs> anyway so yeah the Buster Blade is is actually pretty goddamn good I like it a lot and then you got the hammer a boost hammer so it's basically in its title it's a boost hammer so like you get like a boost stream like just fly out the back of it and it increases the damage I'm guessing because I never used it before and then the next is the spear charge spear I don't really know what that does either so if y'all want to look at that you know comment or whatever and then they got a scythe my brother's using this one on the on the Vita too, and then the combos for the scythe looks pretty damn cool. And we already at the part where uh, you get your blood your blood art, so it's like they look legit. It's decent. So I'm like, yeah, this shoes look awesome. You unlock your blood art in this um, area down here, the one that is um, the arrow is on, and that it um that's it. But um, what else? I think that's about it. Yes. Oh shit! I ain't going by myself. My God. Julius, Nana, and Romeo. Finished. All right, let's go. So that might just be a um, um, long blade player in, in this one. Instead of a uh, Buster Blade. We've confirmed the God Eater's arrival in the combat some, area. Let's get to work. Some decent combos. And a secret uh, move on here that I can do. Well, it's not secret, but it's um, R R1 and Bot. You get this, and you press Bot again, you get a, a boost at that. So it's like a basically an ender, a better ender if you want to use the combos. But the thing is, after you do that, you can get a whole nother combo. Where did that shiny just go? I think I was looking at this one. I don't know. I saw two. Oh, whatever. Oh, let's see. Let's look around real quick. Make sure I don't miss no shinies. Oh shit. Can I get it? Can I get it? Yeah, I got it. Mm -hmm. Let's get to yeah, work. Level three, so I gotta get him. Alright. So, um... So glad okay. you're here. My daughter is your biggest fan. Oh, oh, is she now? Thank you so much. I don't deserve such praise. Come now, miss. Don't be so modest. Miss, you know, we are truly grateful that you've agreed to help improve Fenrir's public image. <laughs> it's my pleasure. It's thanks to Fenrir that supplies are getting to those beats. I'm just proud to help in any way I can. Then, how about a concert at our headquarters? Surely having your beauty among them would boost the troops' morale. I see if sorry, they beast like this, I... generous offer, really. But, um, I'd rather not leave the Far East right now. 
Once the food shortage in the satellite bases has been resolved, I'll gladly consider it. Yes, of course. I'll talk with HQ myself and see what can be done. I'll have those outliers fed without delay. That's wonderful. Thank you so much. Damn, these Come, let's sit legit. and discuss the arrangements. You know, you guys are way too reckless. Always charging in at the origami. You gotta stay back. You know, analyze the enemy's movement. Sounds like being a chicken to me. <laughs> hey, no, no, it's getting kind of close there. Oh, yeah. so sorry about it. Yeah. What are you kids doing? Miss Yuno, I apologize for this behavior. Please, it's fine. Careful there, you three. You shouldn't be horsing around in the lobby. I know you don't want to disturb our important guests. Right. Sorry, Dr. Leia. It won't happen again. My apologies for those rude children. I am ashamed. They're really only good for fighting, you know. Uh, I think we lost well, Romeo. That's rude. What's that weird look? Do you not know who that was? That's Yuno Ashihara! Ah! Uh, do you know what he's talking about? Are you no. kidding me right now? That's Yuno, the most awesome idol ever to live. She's so pretty. I can't believe I almost touched her. Why? The one time I don't turn my camera. You like my mask? Uh, that's lit, right? Some on my skin. I won't be taking a shower tonight, that's for sure. Really? Uh, Romeo, I think everyone would appreciate it if you kept showering. Thanks. Not a chance. That was once in a lifetime. A glimpse of you. No. How do you not get this? All right. Well, whatever. Come on, let's get going. Okay, anyway, I hope you devils enjoyed part one of Guy Eater 2. Um, if you like, you know, give your boy that young like button, you feel me? If you're new to the channel, subscribe and uh, comment if you want to see, um, see me play with a different weapon. Um, or, you know, go through the customization options or any of that junk. But um, until then, I see you devils in the next one. <laughs> Shake my head, no. Peace.